Hey guys, Emma Ray here again. Just doing a really quick video on this guy. I think I got him to the point where I'm finally happy with him. I'm using a Rain Man head sculpt that I picked up on eBay on a true type body. Just got this new poncho in and I think it's perfect. Um, got it from a fellow Sideshow Freaks forum member by the name of uh, Bernard2002. Just a great poncho and I really needed it to finish off this figure because it hangs and drapes nicely on this 1-6 scale figure. <clears throat> Did a little weathering on the uh, pants. You see some light dusting there on the bottom of the uh, pants there. And cell bags also have a little bit of weathering that I added. And some light dusting on the uh, poncho and on top of the hat and so forth. Tried to make it a little bit more worn looking, not too perfect. And uh, I'm pretty happy. A really great figure, if I can say so myself. A little bit of weathering on the boots. Got all the details. Got the... Uh, snakes on the uh, handles there. So he looks like he's ready to draw and take out some bad guys. So there's another uh, figure probably coming out soon by Denny Kim with a head sculpt by Trevor Grove that I'll be looking into. That'll probably be the ultimate version of Blondie. But in the meantime, I'm really happy with this uh, bashed figure. And uh, many thanks to my friend Steve Ortiz, Army Soldier on the Sideshow Freaks forums for hooking me up with most of the uh, figure that you see here. And again, you know, I had to bash the rest, change the head sculpt, new poncho, and uh, did a little bit of weathering here and there. That's about it, guys. Just a really quick video. wanted to share this great figure with you guys. A long-time favorite, an old-time uh, hero of mine, Blondie, from uh, The Good, The Bad, The Ugly, <clears throat> the uh, Man With No Name series as portrayed by Clint Eastwood. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye!